the sixth rule is power rule if y equal to fx power of n then derivative of y dy dx equal to n times fx power of n minus 1 times derivative of fx example y equal to 3x squared plus 2 power of 4 so differentiate y dy dx equal to fx is 3x squared plus 2 n is 4 so n 4 times fx 3x squared plus 2 n minus 1 is 3 and then derivative of fx is 6x simplify function 4 times 6 is 24 x and 3x squared plus 2 cubed Second example, y equal to 2x power of 4 minus 9x plus 6 cubed. So differentiate y, we have dy dx. 3 to the front, fx is 2x power of 4 minus 9x plus 6, 3 minus 2 square. And then differentiate fx, we have 8x cubed minus 9. Simplify function, 24x cubed minus 27 2x power of 4 minus 9x plus 6 square. Next, we have gradient. Gradient of y equal to m equal to dy dx. Example, find the gradient of the curve y equal to x square plus 7x minus 2 at the point 2, 16. Gradient is dy dx. So we have y equal to x square plus 7x minus 2. So differentiate y dy dx. Differentiate x square, we have 2x, 7x, 7, and differentiate negative 2, we have 0. So gradient is 2x plus 7. And then at point 2, 16, dy dx equal to 2x is 2 plus 7. So 4 plus 7 is 11. Therefore, the gradient of the curve y equal to x squared plus 7x minus 2 at point 216 is 11. Second example, find the points on the curve y equal to x cubed minus 6x minus 10 where gradient is negative 3. So in this case, question given us the gradient which is dy dx is the gradient equal to negative 3. Differentiate y, we have dy dx equal to 3x squared minus 6. And we know that dy dx equal negative 3, so 3x squared minus 6 equal to negative 3. 3x squared minus 3 equal to 0. x squared minus 1 equal to 0. x plus 1, x minus 1 equal to 0. So x equal negative 1 and 1. When x equal to negative 1, y equal to negative 1 cubed minus 6 times negative 1 minus 10 equal to negative 5 and when x equal to 1 y equal to 1 cubed minus 6 times 1 minus 10 equal to negative 15 therefore the points are negative 1, negative 5, and 1, negative 15. These are the exercises for this lesson. These are the answers for the exercises. Please submit the exercises at the end of lecture.